got it right. Get under that. Give me a board. Where's my floor being sunk? Screwed up. Okay. Just about right. Ah, oh, let's see. I'm gonna hit my set it down. I think so. Good. Right. Let's do a little bit of cleaning. Um, oil pan maybe. A little dirty. Let's uh, drop her down. Shows I had enough fluid just just for the heck of it while I've got it while I've got it here. Let's see how high, see how high she'll go up. It'll tell me if I got how much fluid I got in it. You didn't have enough fluid in it, so I don't know exactly what what happened. Just to give me an idea how much. Look, I got nine, and how high, how high I can get it. Yep, all I'm going to do is plug in the exhaust, a couple of the hoses. Got the alternator, I kept the alternator. AC compressor. All I gotta do is swap stuff around from one motor to the other. My only concern is what my distributor, distributor, and my uh, coil, coil plug are gonna do here. Get much. He didn't get because that'll go right in there right now. See how high it can go. Looks like I got plenty of fluid in mine. That's more that's that's the same height as a pickup truck. Pickup truck bed.
actually done. Okay, here we go. As you can see, it works really good. So we're up as high as, I still got a little ways to go, but there's no reason to have it any higher than that, actually. Okay, let's bring her back down. <laughs> had enough, had enough fun right now. I just wanted to make sure we were able to do that. I don't have to add any fluid to the... my resting place so I can uh, get, get what I want it. motor in until sometime around in March maybe March or April I'll go on to this one I got to do the Explorer first so you're gonna you're gonna join me on my uh, trek down to Corning which is about 60 miles from here um, so I can get that Gotta get that motor, but uh, that's gonna be my that's gonna be my projects now for a while. I'm gonna be doing the uh, doing motors, so that should be that'll be uh, interesting for you that are following me doing the Explorer, and then I'll be coming back and do the do the Mustang. Then uh, I've got to do a uh, undercarriage on a escape the next one will be a, uh, um, a lower like I said a uh, sub subframe for an Explorer uh, escape so um, that will uh, I've got plenty of, plenty of little jobs to do here This, this one here is under the last time I worked on the Mustang. Oh, what are we doing now? Nice. Well, that just, as far as I'm concerned, this thing just paid for itself. Pull, pull the pins out. Oh, 
That is, as you can see, it is, it is tippy. In the position it's in right now. Oops. Anyway, there we go. Project on how to uh, uh, fix the holes in the concrete here. All right, so there we go. We got her. We got her installed. Um, what I need to do here? Freaking thing cover. Not wanting to fall inside your manifold. That would be a bad situation. So we got a combination of two, three. This one here. Should have no problem carrying a motor around. Uh, I did push my carpet up as we were sliding it in. Uh, I can sit like that. I've got plenty of cardboard. You know, gonna see it's sitting on sitting on my my battery. Ah, not a good, not a good thing. All right. So there we go. Thanks for watching. Thanks for following me. Hopefully, you're learning, learn what not to do <laughs> from uh, from my videos. So we're giving you ideas to make. This is the way I did it. Now you can do it your way. And hopefully, uh, of course, it works out better for you. There we go. So, all right. So, uh, my next video is I got to put uh, black pipe on the back of my uh, my good old stove here. Because I've got a big old three and a half inch hole on the back side that I didn't know was there. <laughs> Not good. Not good at all. And uh, after about six or seven years, as you can hear, really brill. Ah, so, all right, again, thanks for following me. I appreciate you coming along. And uh, you'll catch me on the next. Ah, in fact, well, right here, I'll show you exactly what that puppy is going into. There she is. We're going to put that motor in that. So again, thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, definitely share. We'll catch you on the next. The last time I...